What is happening, people? I got a long match against a ga um, Jay Jirachi from YouTube. He contacted me, said let's have a standard battle with the max of three OUs. I was like, no problem. So uh, I lead with Zangoose, and he leads with Gallade. He burns me, which pretty much ruins my uh, Zangoose. So I kind of just leave him in and do try to do some damage as he kills me with Brick Break, because my Zangoose is a flailing one and he it, the main point is to get down to your sash but since he burned me it doesn't really matter so uh... off to a pretty bad start i go to go out to smeargle and he switches out to his uh... shaman and i spore and he predicted the spore because shaman has natural cure he switches it back out to his glade and i set up a layer of spikes and it, I was talking to him on MSN, and he, uh, when I spored him here, he said, God, I thought you would forget about the natural cure. But no, I'm not going to forget about the natural cure. So anyways, um, he switches out here and goes into his Raikou as I set up another layer of spikes, I think. Yeah, I set up another layer of spikes, and um, he's getting his leftovers. I switch out to... Um, my blissy, my biggest loser, because it's fat. <laughs> and, uh, so anyways, uh, he discharges and that does about, like, 80 damage. Anyways, um, so he switches out and goes out to Shaman, predicting the T-Wave, which is a good prediction. And, um, Shaman is an enemy of my blissy, because Leech Seed really ruins my blissy, because they get a bunch of health, and I don't get any health. So, eh. Uh, Anyway, so he leech seeds me there, and I uh, seismic toss him, and I noticed that from the leech seed, I lose almost 100 health, so I know that he's getting almost 100 health, which means that my seismic tosses won't be doing much of anything. So, uh, keeping Blissey in here any longer is kind of, uh... Uh, not working into my schedule here, so I just go out to uh, Infernate Planet of the Apes and uh, to take the seed floor, and he takes like a boss. And I know he's gonna be afraid of the fire move, so he switches out, and I set up a Swords Dance on the switch. I Stone Edge his um, Dragonite, and thank God it hit. So uh, yeah. And Life Orb takes me down a little bit, and he goes out to Raikou, and I'm thinking, Alright, Discharge won't kill me. It won't kill me. I'm saying it to myself like ten times, it's not going to kill me. It doesn't kill me. And I know that Life Orb takes 29 hit points from me, and I'm thinking, Alright, I can live that, and uh, I can live Life Orb, so uh, Infernape is doing pretty good out here. So he goes out to Shaman, and I'm thinking, okay, I'm just going to use a uh, Flare Blitz on you. But he withdraws and goes out to Snorlax. So, yeah, it takes some spike damage, and I Flare Blitz him. And it takes him out, which I thought was awesome. But it takes him out with a crit, and I'm still trying to figure out if that mattered. I'm still doing damage calculations. I need to talk to him a little more about his stat boosts and whatever. So, uh, or his EV, EVs and that thing. So, yeah, that was cool how I took it out with a crit anyways. Um, so I go out to Smeargle and he goes out to Glade. I set up, uh, Stealth Rocks as he's still asleep and I set up, uh, my second layer of spikes. I think it was my second layer. Um, so, or no, that was my third layer probably. Uh, anyways, I taunt him because I, I haven't really seen this uh, Gallade's full moveset, and I don't know if it's uh, going to set anything up on me. So I taunt him, and then I go out to uh, Hypnotoad to take whatever physical move he has, because Hypnotoad is boss. Except I saw much of that did, and I'm thinking, what the heck is going on? And he gets a crit. So that's, like, really gay right there, that crit. I guess I kind of counteracts the uh, Snorlax crit, because if, I didn't get, if he didn't get that crit on me, I wouldn't... Uh, I wouldn't have switched out later on, but more of that later. Anyways, so uh, he brick breaks me again. It doesn't do too much. He brick breaks again, and I go for the hypnosis, and it hits. So that's good. And um, so he's sleeping like a little baby over there, and I'm uh, getting some leftovers with my uh, bulk up over here. And he switches out and goes to Shaman, and I'm like, oh, 
god. At this point, I'm thinking, if I had full health, I could have taken a seed flare. But I don't have full health. So, um... Or if I had more health, because of that crit. So I have to switch out, and I go out to Leonardo, and I'm thinking, alright. To take this thing out, I have to use Blissey, but I can't let him get Leech Seed on me, or else I'm not going to be able to do anything. So I go to Leonardo, and he Seed Flares me in with 4 HP, which is pro, and I taunt him so he can't use any Leech Seeds on me. And I know he knows now that if he switches out, he's going to die by my Spikes and Stealth Rock, so he has to, he has to keep Seed Flaring, but, um... Anyways, but my Leonardo living with 4 HP didn't matter, because I had a Focus Sash on him anyways. And, um... So, yeah, 369 HP, lol, 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 Anyways, so he's just seed flaring away, hoping for a special defense drop, but he doesn't get it, and it didn't really matter if he got a special defense drop there, because I was going to switch out anyway. So, yeah, take out his Shaman with another Seismic Toss, and looking pretty good for me here. He goes out to Gallade, and I know I can't stay in here, even though it's asleep, because if it wakes up, I'm screwed. So I go back out to Hypnotoad here. And, uh, he's sleeping like a little baby, and I think this is where he gets, like, extra long sleep turns, which is more hacks, but, you know, this match was full of hacks. So, uh, yeah. Go for a waterfall and it gets a crit, but it doesn't really matter because he sleeps for another turn, and two waterfalls would have killed it regardless, so the crit didn't really matter. And, um... So there's another waterfall, and that's going to take out the Gallade. And he's down to his last poke, which I think... Yeah, this is Registeel. And this Registeel gets hacked up the ass today. <laughs> like, uh, So I hypnosis it, and it, it has a Chesto Berry, so it wakes up and gets Gravity. So I'm thinking, Gravity? What? I've never seen this Registeel before. And, uh, apparently this Registeel is a gravity zap cannon Registeel. So, uh, he zap cannons and it misses, which is all oh, 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 because zap cannon has 80 accuracy in gravity, but it missed. So, I keep brick breaking him, and he zap cannons again, but it misses. And, yeah, brick break again, and that's gonna take out the Registeel. But, I don't really think the zap cannons really... Ma missing mattered because I still had some a lot of pokes left to take out Registeel, but I guess it would have changed the outcome a little bit. So yeah, it's my mouse and good game, Jay Drachi and uh, comment, rate, subscribe. Don't forget to check out the um, tournament on Arcanine forums. I'll put the link in the description again. It's a standard tournament, so yeah, go sign up on Arcanine Forums and sign up for the tournament. I'll uh, check you later.